Joseph Girard can keep the ball rolling tonight. 2-1 to one on Havacadabra. He's been a hot ticket in the claiming box. He's been hot in the winner's circle, too. Three straight scores. We'll see if he can deliver here tonight for trainer Victor Putty off the claim. It's post time for race two. Second race set for a start. They are off and trotting. Big speed from Joseph Girard in the center. Smackdanell puts him in hustle mode. Outside of him is back to peace, even wider, have a cadaver. Then it's back to Just Call Me Ronald, who's pressing out for position. Jayport Sunrise doesn't want to give up her position. She's right now in the two hole trip. So three wide, they battle over the quarter pole. Establishing the lead is Joseph Girard. He made the lead, he made it easily in the pocket spot. Trotting up in second, Jayport Sunrise. That long shot has the favorite, have a cadaver at her flank and trotting up to challenge now. Taken back and forth at the rail. That is Just Call Me Ronald, and off the speed in fifth. There's back to peace. Six Sixth inside to Audrey Pearl, seventh underway comes Thunder away, further back to Blush and Crush, a gap of two to Wind Shield, Tra still trailing Tim T. Field comes to the midway point, and it's McDonnell and Joseph Gerard operating a two and a half length lead. Dropped in second when Havacadabra into the safety lane off stride is Audrey Pearl. Audrey Pearl is on the run, half and 55 and one. 28-1 in that second split. So McDonnell and Joseph Gerard rolling along here on a six-length lead with three eights to go. Have a cadaver back in second. Here outside comes Just Call Me Ronald from in third. Tipped out fourth, Jayport Sunrise. And far outside fifth comes Thunder Away. Three quarters of a mile. And Joseph Gerard. Has he got anything left? Joseph Gerard spins by three quarters in 124 and two, and he's still on top by five, cutting into the deficit with every stride. Those just call me Ronald, but still five lengths in arrears. Way back up on the outside, Blush and Crush coming on with some late speed from in third, and it's Joseph Gerard who just keeps on rolling here. He's out to an eight length lead now with a 16th of a mile of racetrack to cover, and Joseph Gerard took the bottom out of this field big time. Joseph Gerard wins by open lengths. Coming on to get second, clear cut, second best was Blush and Crush, great horse race for the show, show spot, windshield got up for third, thunder away fourth in 154 and four.